Do you ever find yourself reminiscing about sweets from the past? Maybe it's the taste, the texture or even just the packaging that brings back a flood of memories. Whatever it is, there's something about childhood sweets that gets us feeling all nostalgic. And in today's video, I'm going to be looking at one sweet in particular that invariably gets mentioned when talk turns to confectionery that we would like to see make a comeback. Spangles. I'm sure most of you will have fond memories of Spangles. Although basically just a simple boiled sweet, Spangles are perhaps Britain's most missed confectionery item, often topping polls asking which discontinued brand the British public would like to see return. Just what is it about this humble sweet that makes us so nostalgic and misty-eyed whenever the Spangles name is mentioned? Maybe it's the fact that Spangles were popular during two distinct eras in Britain, the immediate post-war years and the more liberated decade of the 1970s. Spangles were first introduced to the British public by Mars in 1948, at a time when sweets were still subject to rationing. They were an instant hit with kids and adults alike as they only required one ration point to buy rather than many sweets which required two. The marketing campaigns were also highly effective, although some of the advertising probably wouldn't be acceptable today. A standard packet of Spangles contained a variety of fruit flavours – strawberry, blackcurrant, orange, pineapple, lemon and lime, and the non-fruit flavour cola. Many single flavour packs were also introduced over the years including barley sugar, licorice, tangerine and butterscotch. There were also mint varieties and an Old English pack. Mars decided to modernise the Spangles packaging in 1974 and it's probably this iteration of the sweet that many of us will remember today. The 70s style font on the packaging and the new fizzy flavours of lemonade, orangeade and cola brought this most traditional of sweet up to date and more attractive to the 70s market. A new TV advertising campaign was also launched featuring a young actor who would go on to become one of Britain's favourite comedy stars. Can you spot who it is? Did you spot the future comedy great? Well done if you said... Nicholas Lindhurst. So, just what happened to Spangles? Well, Mars decided to discontinue the brand in 1984, probably due to boiled sweets being seen as rather old-fashioned by this time. Having already updated the flavour varieties in the 70s, there wasn't really much more Mars could do to modernise this most traditional of sweet for the typical 80s consumer. There was brief hope for Spangles fans that their favourite sweet would once more live on when Woolworths reintroduced the brand as an exclusive in 1994. However, as a limited edition special, it was only a very brief return for Britain's most fondly remembered sweet. So, that was the story of Spangles, Britain's most missed sweet. While we may never get to taste them again, the memories they evoke are a testament to the enduring power of childhood sweets to bring us joy and comfort. And, who knows, maybe one day Spangles will make another comeback. Until then, we'll just have to savour the memories. If you've enjoyed the memories in this video, then why not try one of these other nostalgic trips back to the past, available on the channel now. As always, thanks for watching Stuview TV, always full of nostalgic goodness.